Well, we're all worried about where the next pound's coming from, aren't we? And uh, how we're going to get by every day. And one of the people I think about a lot is the pensioners. Uh, you know, a lot of times, my mother-in-law is one of them, actually. Their only source of income is the state pension. So, you know, you have to think, are they going to get enough to get by on? <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel, hope you're doing alright. Let me know how you are in the comments below and uh, everything's okay where you are. Well, pensioners, yes, we're in for a, a state pension increase uh, which was uh, announced. But the thing is, when? When is it going to happen? Uh, it's going to go up by 10.1%, uh, which is slightly below the rate of inflation at the moment. The good news is a triple lock is remaining in place. For those of you that don't know what the triple lock is, uh, it means that the uh, pension will track either the rate of inflation or the average earnings, whichever is the higher. And the rate of inflation is done uh, for September of the previous year, and average earnings is done between May and July of the previous year or it will go up by 2.5%, uh, depending on which one is the highest out of those three options. Triple lock, there we go, and that's staying in place. Now, the 10.1% uh, increase is going to happen in April. Now, what does that mean? If you're on the new state pension, uh, I think that is anyone that retired after April 2016. It's an extra 19 quid a week. If you're... Uh, on the old system before April 2016 it's an extra 14 quid a week in your skyrocket but inflation uh, reached 10.7 percent in December so this is ever so slightly below it the other thing to consider as well they're actually talking about and I, I mentioned this the other day about shifting the retirement age uh, I mean at the moment it is 66 I think for men and women uh, let me just check that. I think I'm telling you the correct information. Uh, I hope I am. Uh, yeah, 66 for both men and women, and in 2028 it will uh, increase to 67. Now, they were talking, as I said in a video the other day, about bringing in a change, shoving it up to 68, and they're talking about bringing that change forward from when it was. But in any event, I think legally they have to give us at least a decade's notice of any change. So I we'll have to keep an eye on that. Anyway, that's it for the pensions. Let me know in the comments below if you've got anything. And uh, I'll see you with another one soon. Doodaloo.